was hungry, now when the game turned greedy Was known to be needy, now was people that need me Battling up the dead because I What's up everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street Got the week 3 game going up against the Miami Dolphins AFC team doesn't really make the playoffs that much I haven't seen them in the playoffs since like I don't even remember <laughs> I haven't seen him, man, but you see Demetrius meet Turner giving the pep talk of approval. Devin has to write in the middle of that circle, but they do end up getting the ball first. They in some type of weak eye form. Looked like a strong guy that was just flipped. But anyway, it is on all man like I've been saying before, and it doesn't really matter what the computer does because you can't stop it. I am 2-0, but I don't even know how, how I have the number one ranked defense in this owner mode right now you can see this run I, I have the number one ranked defense in like the 27th 28th offense or something so I'm really getting faded on offense I can't do anything against them and the computer is thinking I'm stopping them but I don't see it at all but um you can see I, I, I'm winning games I don't know what I'm talking I'm 2 and though but it doesn't feel like a good 2 and though I haven't blown any teams out it's been frustrating trying to play these games but you can see I'm mixing it up now. I'll do the screen a couple times just to get the passing game going. And Jaquiz Rogers does some tippy toes on the sideline just to stay in bounds. So on second and seven, we ended up running up the middle. And he gets the lucky hit from behind the game, like six and a half yards. And we just run it again on third down just to make sure that we get the first. So now we in the red zone. I'm starting to run it way more. You can see Devontae Freeman with his first rush of the game. It's for 16 yards. Then, unfortunately, he gets out the game. Because Jaquiz Rogers, he wasn't tired no more. And he gets the touchdown of that Hulk formation. Now, I am using the Colts playbook, as I said before. It's actually pretty nice. The Wildcat in it. And the Wild, it's like a power O. Some type of power out of the Wildcat. And it's actually really nice. We've got a decent type speed. Running back. Playing the quarterback position, I had LeGarrette Blunt and I was doing it, so you don't really need a, a speed back to do it at all. You can see they're just breaking tackles right now, and luckily Spruce ends up making it, stopping them short. But later on in the drive, they do convert the first, and we try to blitz, but I'm trying to blitz, trying to play man. I'm trying to do everything I can to stop that. And you look at this run, I hit him in the backfield, broke the tackle. Got hit another three times and he ended up just falling over the first down line. I mean, it was only second down, but that was really like something. I, I just, you gotta give up. Like, it's all Madden. Not everything's gonna work, but plays like that, you would think they will. So I'm blitzing, sending seven people. The, Tannehill ends up throwing it, trying to throw it away. Paul Warrello ends up picking it up before it hits the ground. They didn't even review this or anything. That was a horrible angle to even see if they, they can get that back. But um, it didn't hit the ground, I guess, because Warlo just picked it up, got a nice interception, and it was tough, man. I, I like that interception. Meek giving the clap of approval, and now we back on offense. So it's tied up. I'm trying to get away. I end up passing it to Toy Lolo. He doesn't break any tackles, even though he's like 6'6", six, 6'7". Six, six, no tackles broken by him. But Jaquez Rogers, big hole. Luckily, Bear Pasco is in the game in the block downfield. He is an excellent blocker. I do like using him in the running situation to be handed off to Paul DeMarco. Running people over out of the Hulk formation. Spin move into the touchdown with Jaquiz Rogers. But he is wilding this guy. That's his second rushing touchdown and the second touchdown of the whole Falcons team. So it's going to be good, man. Joe Phil, not he's not happy about that. I'm feeding his defense. Meat Turner looking like Quincy Blunt in the back if you saw that, but it's not him. Um, I did get asked about if I'm going to bring the Quincy Blunt series back, and of course I am. I just don't know when I'm going to start continuing it again. And on fourth and inches, we just hand it off to the fullback again, so get the first down. A pass play right here. We give the ball to Julio. I haven't really seen me do this lately in the video, but we ended up doing the out route, get the little juke the back juke and be going for a touchdown with Julio like he's really really fast <laughs> he burned a whole lot of defenses and uh, he burned the Saints I think on the first week and he's just fast I think it was the same out route too I do like trying to change it up though I'm, I'm thinking about getting another scheme together 
but you can see my bad tackling takes into play there. It was a first and 10. I had him stop for at least like a three yard gain. I tried to hit stick, he jukes me. I tried to hit stick him again for like a six yard gain. I got juked again. So you know, he ended up getting the first. But later on in the drive, man, we trying to kill him, trying to get the ball loose. And they're just running the ball right now. It was a nice spin move, and he's just breaking tackles. Like, he does not want to go down. Who is this running back, and why does he not have his own type of beast mode? But they don't end up scoring a touchdown on the drive. They just simply kick the field goal because our goal line defense is tough. Try to do the same thing with Roddy White like on the last drive, but we couldn't get him. He couldn't get out of that uh, back juke quick enough, so he did get tackled, hit him with the uh, curl route. And then he gets the play. <sighs> I was looking at this, and I really just shook my head, man. I don't, it's all Madden. It bounced off a player's helmet, and then they caught the interception. I mean, I have to throw one a game. We end up blitzing the cornerback on fourth down. True font with the blitz, with the sack. And luckily, it, they didn't score any points off of that, because that was really the ultimate cheese button. That the computer just pulled on me so we ended up passing to Devin Hester basically in the flats and he gets in I think that's like his first or either second probably just the first receiving touchdown this year but uh we blowing him out right now I think it's 28 to 10 after this meet again Quincy Blunt in the back and um yeah I, I, I just don't know when I'm gonna bring Quincy Blunt back I know I'm, I am though so don't worry about that just the timing though I maybe mean, they end up on their drive, third and like four, they get like 30 yards downfield. The game is pretty much over. It's fourth down. They're converting it. I don't care. Man. I'm, I'm just playing as the D line right now. I'm just getting things set up. Just trying to stop him. And you can see we almost get another pick, but I guess his awareness was not that good. Try to bring a corner blitz and it gets picked up again. But they threw it like short of the first down. Like it was, I don't understand that, man. Tannehill. He, he's slacking. So we end up get, stopping him again. They don't get any points. Tory Lolo trying to do the back juke. Way too big. He's definitely not quick enough to do it like Julio Jones. We find Jaquiz. Put a nice move on one of the safeties. But then he ends up getting tackled. Back to Julio again. The same out route that we scored on before. Doesn't score on him this time. But this time we put him on a streak. Switching it up. You got to run the same thing. But you always have to switch it up. Man. That's my offense. You, you're going to run the same stuff over and over. Meet Turner with the finger of approval. But you're going to have to switch it up. And when you do, it's going to be a big play. I ended up messing up right there. So they did get a touchdown at the end of the game. But it didn't really matter. It was 35-17. to 17. In the end, we win another game. So it's 3-0 and for the season. Meet Turner. Handshake of approval. You know what I'm saying? Fade and Joe Philbin. Who is Ryan Tannehill? I don't know. Julio Jones, though. Four receptions. Two touchdowns. Over 100 yards. So it was definitely a good game for Julio. He was wild. And the play of the game is that back juke that left that cornerback slipping. Like he dove, but Julio was gone. Man. <laughs> but this video is coming to an end. So always remember, in the street we trust, I'm out.